lot of blood, sweat, and tears that goes into farming. Once you start doing it, it becomes a lifestyle. It's not just a job anymore. It's a lifestyle. It's something of a legacy, really, if you will. It's, it's something we've grown into and we've been born into. I enjoy what I do. I enjoy raising pigs. I enjoy taking care of them. I enjoy farming the ground. It's just a good way of life. It's a good place to raise a family. Family is the most important thing. I got into farming because of my family and I hope to pass that on to my children and their children and so on and so forth. I've been married to my wife for just over two years and we have a one-year-old daughter. Her name is Ren Lorraine. She is the smallest ball of fire that I've ever seen. I honestly can't wait until she's a little bit older and she can go in there and I can see her running around with the little pigs when we get it, man. I'm a third generation corn and soybean farmer on our family's grain farm. And I also produce purebred Duroc show pigs and breeding stock that we market throughout the country. Treatment and care of animals in our business is paramount. We're constantly keeping them warm in the wintertime, we're keeping them cool in the summertime to their nutrition to make sure that they've got the diet that they need. Truthfully, if the animals aren't comfortable and if the animals aren't taken care of, then we aren't being the very best we can be, and it really goes hand in hand. So when they're not in school, our kids are here and they're a part of our day-to-day -day operation. They see every aspect of the farm just like Christy or I or my parents would see. Whether they like it or not, they're learning different things about responsibility and work ethic and that even if maybe you don't feel good, you've still got to go do your chores and make sure that, that the animals are taken care of. Welcome to Bergner Pork Incorporated. It's nice working with family. We get along so well is what really makes it tick. I have my areas that I like to go do as far as, you know, planting and harvesting. And Chad likes the trucking part of it. And Brett likes more the maintenance of the hog side of it. And our fourth brother, Chris, he mostly works in the uh, farrowings, breeding. And it's nice to know that your workforce is going to be there every morning. We have a lot of things that we need to be responsible for. Everyone needs to take care of the environment, just be good stewards of the land. With technology, we see apps for your phone that will help you diagnose a respiratory disease. Or if there's a problem with the temperature in a building, we have alarms that call our phones so that we can see what's wrong and take care of it. These advancements, a lot of them help us save time and just help us in better pig care. It's a great sense of pride that the hogs that we sell, the uh, meat's good. I'm feeding a lot of people in the world. It's very rewarding knowing that I can spend a lot of time and everyone in the world can reap the benefits. Five generations ago they started this and five generations from now I hope we'll still be doing this.